Too many difficult worlds now. So, this must be Garland's haunted mansion. Talk about bad taste in interior decorating. Alright, time to teach this tyrant a thing or two. And no safe here. Great, cause... Yeah, obviously there is no Moogle here. So, we meet again. Who are you? Twelve years ago, I lost one of my most prized genomes. I created him and sent him to Gaia to disrupt the cycle of souls there. You are that genome. I am glad you have returned. Shut up! Nobody tells me what to do! And I didn't come here to answer to you! Let me guess, you must be Garland! And what if I am? Then you're going down, but first, you're gonna tell me everything! Like, why did I grow up on Gaia? And why do you want to destroy it? I have no intention of destroying Gaia. I only wish to make Gaia into terror. What did you just say? Of course, not everything went as planned. You growing up on Gaia, for example. There is another one built as you were. He may be the one who threw a wrench into my jeers. He? Who the heck are you talking about? Someone you know quite well. Follow me. The time when the aura of Gaia will turn to the crimson glow of Terra has not yet come. I may need your help anyway. Wait, there is no treasure hidden here, right? Perhaps so. Pandemonium. A place where the soul rests. Stop! Oh. We need to learn how to fly. No, tell me everything! I constructed the genomes to be vessels for the souls of the people of Terra when they are awakened. But 24 years ago, I gave life to a genome that was very much like you. His will was too strong to make him into a proper vessel, and I even considered discarding him. But then I thought that I should put his strength to use. I send the genome as my servant to disrupt the cycle of souls on Gaia. Yeah, so tell me who he is already. <laughs> it's kind of hard to say that. Do you not yet know? You and he are so much alive. Alike? I've never met anyone like me. You judge only by appearances. I mean someone with a soul similar to yours. The one I send to Gaia might also be called your brother. And his name is Kuja. Kuja? He's a genome? Impossible! He doesn't even have a tail! He is only hiding it. He denies his own identity. He rejects the meaning of his existence and tries to assert his own individuality. Don't you see the resemblance? Shut up! I'm not like him at all! He say the same thing when speaking about the other genomes 
I'm not like this guy's. His ambition was on the coming of a Gino, but it was perfect for the mission I gave him. To bring war and chaos to Gaia. That was what I sent him to do. To induce an unnaturally chaotic flow. So then, why? The disruption of the flow of souls is best brought about by war. What he did for me far exceeded my brother's expectations. What about me? How did I end up on Gaia? When you received the gift of life in Pranpo, Kujo could not bear it. He could not bear to see a genome with more power than his own. He felt threatened. Kujo discarded you. He dropped you onto Gaia, the world he would destroy. So, I was to be your slave just like Kuja, to start a war on Gaia? That is correct. I did not expect Kuja to abandon you, but I believe it was his nature. And to him, bringing war to Gaia would prove his victory over you. Perhaps it is because of his desire to justify his existence that he let you live as well. So, that is why the blood of thousand had to be spilled? Are you referring to Kuja's ambition or to our plan to disrupt the cycle of souls? Both! And what exactly do you gain by disrupting that cycle of souls or... Whatever! And it's gone again. This this is what's happening in this... That's why Terra gone, I think. Because everybody just hate to this conf conversation somehow. We must sort the souls. I want to disrupt Gaia's cycle and drain its souls, filling the void with the souls of Terra. To speed the cycle of souls is to speed the world as a whole. Thus, war. And in time, Gaia's souls are gone. And Gaia becomes Terra. But how? You saw it with your own eyes. You saw the evil tree and the mist it emits. The role of the Eva tree is that of soul divider. The mist you see comprises the stagnant souls of Gaia. Oh yeah? But we stopped the mist! So much for that! All you saw was the back of the tree. Even now, the Eva tree blocks the flow of Gaia's souls, while it lets those of Terra flow free. Come and see for yourself, see the true form of this planet. What is this? Think of it as an observatory, a place to measure the radiance of Gaia and Terra. What are you talking about? Uh, what is this weird light? That is the center of the planet. The end and the beginning of the cycle of souls. The light remains Gaia's, for now. But when the blue changes to crimson, all will belong to Terra, and its restoration will be complete. That is why I wrapped up the light in the Leva tree. To prevent the cycle of the judgment of souls on Gaia from inside the planet. Such is the Eva tree's true purpose. Its true form. 
All you saw was its material form. The flow of Gaia's souls cannot be changed simply by stopping the disposal of mist. So, Kuja is just an angel of death who sends soul to the tree of Eva. Yes, my angel of death. But only until you come of age. What do you mean? His soul is not eternal. I was going to create you next, after all. You mean you won't need Kuja's soul once I grow stronger than him? Precisely. Soon, the time will come. Now you should be fully aware of the meaning of your existence. Yeah, I'm aware of all the laughter, all the tears I've shared with the people I grew up with on Gaia. Forget all that. You are destined to live among the stars for all eternity. You have the power, the position, and the money to do it. I wouldn't want that kind of power. If I only had a place to call home. My brothers in Tantalus, Fifi, Freya, Amara, and Quina, Steiner, Eco, and Dagger. My home is with them in Gaia. If you say I have a motive, then it's to punish all of you who brought pain to my friends. I'll destroy Terra. That's the reason enough to my for my birth here as a genome. Regrettable. I thought your soul would be perfect for a new angel of death. I am the new angel of death. Yours! Don't you know what it means to meet your maker? Shut up! I've heard enough of your crap. I'm taking you out. Right here. Right now. Foolishness. The body becomes a vessel which greets a new soul. What's happening? It's too good to make into a regular genome. But I have no choice. What is given could be taken. <laughs> That's what you forget about, Zidane. Finding your maker does not make any sense, but that's what we are gonna do because that's all Final Fantasy wants to teach us. Fight your fate and embrace your destiny. I can't believe I actually returned to this place. But soon, soon the power will be mine alone. <laughs> Just you wait, Garland, and you too, Sidan. I'll exact sweet revenge upon you both for insulting me. I'll make the people of both Gaia and Terra know who rules over all of them. <laughs> And the invincible come. Be careful with that. So how come Kuja could call invincible? How the summon really works? It never really explained. Or maybe I just don't pay enough attention, as usual. Who am I? Who you are? What is this Jackie Chan movie? I don't know anything. I cannot think at all. Sit down! Yeah. I was called that once. Many people called me that. You always have to show up, don't you? Yeah. Maybe I do. Why, you worthless mendicant! Mendicant! Yep. Sounds about right. 
how very becoming of you. Becoming of me? I really learned a lot by traveling with you, Zidane. Yeah, right. I have nothing to teach. You teach me many things more important than Dusty Mantis! No! I don't know anything! You call that friendship? 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 See that? I don't know. Who are you? You are always there for me. See that? I'm so tired. How come you're always so? I am an empty vessel. See that? <sighs> Wake up, Sudan! <sighs> Come on, Sidan, wake up! Sidan! <sighs> Phoebe! Eagle! Thank you, that's your life! We thought you were dead! Uh, I... We were so worried! Why did you come here all by yourself? What... What are you doing here? Huh? We came to save you, of course. And it wasn't easy. You went off all alone. Leave me alone. Huh? This has nothing to do with you. Ah, oh, come on. There he goes, being the tough guy, Luke Zidane. It's not just about you. Come on, Zidane. Don't be like that. Let's... Shut up! Just shut up, you stupid brat! Zidane. Zidane. Well, thank goodness there is no Materazzi around. <laughs> Sidan, wait up! Unit press, Sidan. Will you little twits just shut up? Okay, <laughs> there is. There is monster here. There is something kids just can't understand. Are we drunk right now? Yeah. There's identity crisis. That's what happened when you got into turtles, Zidane. That's just what happened. Bye you? Oh shoot. Oh, that's bad. Oh, yeah. Thank goodness we have auto potion. Okay, this is bad. This is bad. I don't want to get any game over here. It's a long way to go. Back. Looks like you need some help. Thank you, Freya. Oh, thank goodness. Why Freya? <laughs> Ooh. Hond? So what are you? Can you even take care of yourself? Let's just finish this, okay? Once and for all. Wing Hedge! I'm Lucius. You are too strong, dude. Oh, shit! No, 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 Freya, don't leave me alone! This is bad. What the heck is happening with your speed, man? 
you attack twice, that is not fair, okay? I know we are there are three of us over here, but 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 we're on low level over here, so Don't be like that. Alright, thank goodness. Thank goodness, Freya, that's a good call. Yeah, take that, you monster. I'm enthusiast. I'm not enthusiast in anything. Oh, oh! It is a force level up. That is so cheesy of your game. How foolish of you to go low. Damn hypocrite. Always talking about friendship. When you're nothing but a selfish loner. I can take care of myself. Come back, Zidane. Oh no, this is still gonna be continued? Let me heal myself, at least. God damn it. It's gonna be a game over over here. Oh. Oh, good thing. Queena. Thank goodness. I will not be defeated so easily. No, oh, I'm mad. I cook you good. Steiner. Queena. What are you doing? I want to... I see! <laughs> Damn it, it becomes so long, I need to save! I don't have more time for this. Ah, oh, bad decision as always. 10 minutes is not enough to count on RPGs, so. My bad. Uh, you know what, Steiner? I think I want you just to. Die, maybe? Yeah, that's good. I think Quina could take care of this all by him or herself. I don't want you to get any level up for now. What are you doing now? Okay, not a high win. Kind of scares me. I'm afraid you're gonna do some instant death thing. You cheat bastard. You guys. You know what, Zidane? Let let Queena take care of this, okay? I hope this is the last enemy that we need to fight because I make Zidane into KO if there is another battle with only Zidane because Dagger is still not calm yet that that makes me kind of worry here I hope there is no more battle with only Dagger and Zidane on is only 1 HP. I will be very sure a game over. Hope not, but game's been not very kind <laughs> lately. Yeah, a force experience, so. <laughs> what an unworthy opponent! Zidan, you know I can do this. I still want you to take me days to have lots of food. And I have not yet concluded whether or not you are the right man for her highness, mind you. Oh no, fudge you, Zidan. Just leave me alone. I don't want to trouble you anymore. Ah, oh, damn it. No, no more battle. Ah, oh, shoot, there is a battle again. All a bunch of babysitting bastard. Ah, oh, shoot. But trust me, I know that I'm the worst bastard here. Ah, oh, shoot, man. Damn it, this is gonna be a game over. Damn it! 
What the heck, game? Oh no, you look like something that will cast some... Oh! You restore my HP? Nice. Yep, this is very much what I'm expecting. You will do to me. An earth shake. Pretty much. Oh. Alright. Alright. So, I hope this is a, a very winning scripted battle. Hope so. Another earth shake. I hope it's not random. I hope it just take 10% uh, of my HP. Hope so. Yeah, sort of. Nice. And we have plenty of high potions, so... Well, I hope there is no second phase or anything crazy. Man, I'm so nervous right now. I need to save and just end this part. <laughs> yeah, it's been... Oh. Oh. Hmm, what happening? What is happening? Oh, there's a scripted too. Alright. Dagger. Is this how you want to solve the problem? Your wife was here. Uh, what should I do? Protect, maybe? Maybe just let Dagger die? Because I don't want her to take any experience? Is that it? No, I think game over is... More... Is our prioritize here? To not get any game over. That's what I'm trying to say. How much HP do you have? Okay, I should make... I should do scan with dagger. We never really see... What scans look like. Oh! That's... Bad! Oh, goodness. Auto potion always work every time, it seems. Let's do scan. Shell dragon? Reveal yourself! Scan! Wait, what? I cannot scan? Oh, oh, okay. Okay. I understand now, you are a Dark Soul boss. Not really. But I feel like it. What's with the... What with the music though? <laughs> I don't feel like it fits, but it's not a bad music. It's a potion! Oh, there was a mess in scripted battle! Alright. Jeez, come on, game! Is this supposed to be easy? Oh, okay. You like it? And both of these characters will just get a, have a lot of level up, wasn't it? That sucks. If I know this is what's going to happen, I should at least equip Zidane with a lot of good things. To raise his status. I really don't remember this game, really. From from what point? I, I really forget. Surely not remember about this part. Yeah, Dagger just trying to survive by herself. Because, you know, the smash ability from the boss is kinda 
kind of scary. Yep, this one is kind of scary if I leave Sedan alone in this battle. Yeah, go die or something. Okay. Yeah, you don't want me to get any maximum status within it game. Although I think I could equip some... Yeah, some... an equipment. Was it that, maybe? Dagger! You try to do everything by yourself, don't you? Try to understand. I don't want to cause trouble to anyone. Aren't we your friends? I want to think so. That's why I always... Look, I'm not from Gaia. I was just a hair breath from becoming the destroyer of Alexandria. I can't accept your friendship so easily. You've always protected us. But you still don't understand what we that we look out for you too. We watch your back while you watch ours. And we believe in you the same way you believe in us. Just like you protected us. We want to protect you. Dagger. You say it! My master tell me somebody give you tasties? You give them tasty too. It's good manners. I see no cookies suckle and fuck yet, Zidane. Queen. Chivalry requires a knight to look after his comrade in arms. I will not abandon you. And I shall follow you to kingdom come if I must. You remember that. Steiner. <laughs> what am I going? What am I gonna do with you guys? The feeling is mutual. Alright, let's go. Wait, where are they? The four others. You don't think they've been trapped? Eh, possible. You should not have loved them. That's right. I mean, really. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry. Let's head back. Together. This time. Uh, safe point? Of course not. Of course not. Well, there is Queena, so I could kill other party members. Yeah, thanks, game. By not providing any safe point. It is realistic. Because there, there won't be any Moogle up here, but... Oh no, Malboro. Can we reach us? Yeah, flee. I don't have any confidence fighting Malboro. Ah, not if I meet Malboro without my preparation and my own will. I feel so ambushed right now, so. So ambushed and unprepared. See that? Ah, oh, there is a Moogle here. See that? Why did you leave us? I'm sorry. You're right. I need everyone's help. Don't leave us again, okay? Never. So, you've had a change of heart. What a busy guy. Coming and going all the time. Yeah, but not anymore. We have to stop Garland. Oh yeah, that's right. The Moogle followed me all the way from Brandball. Just tell me if you need to rest, Kippo. Right. Now we can walk our way out of this depressing castle. Because we're all together now. Yeah, get out of my <laughs> party, you bunch of level up guys now. Oh, damn it. I'm so unprepared. 
Oh, oh, sweet spot remembers. You love Mognet? Good for you. Let's replenish high portion for us. Who knows? We might need it. And yeah, I'm going to save and I'm gonna end this part here. I don't know how to cut it yet. But yeah, I'm very out of my time, so. Eh, my bad. Should not have continued an RPG with 10 minutes left. <laughs> That's a bad idea. Okay, 54 32. 54 32, alright. Okay, so this is gonna be the end of this part. Thank you very much for watching, guys. So. Yep, see you again on the next part. I'm mute. Goodbye.